I want to ask you about Special Counsel Robert Mueller's investigation. Uh, he removed an FBI agent over the summer from his team after text messages that this agent sent uh, reportedly revealed an anti-Trump bias. Another top member of Mueller's team's investigators, Andrew Weissman, sent an email to Sally Yates, then the acting attorney general, congratulating her for refusing to enforce the Trump travel ban. And according to the Wall Street Journal, uh, Weissman also attended Hillary Clinton's election night party in New York. Can you understand, if the situations were reversed, why Republicans would look at the, these facts and say, boy, there might really be a problem with bias in the Mueller investigation? You know, Jake, the fact is the circumstances have been reversed uh, in probably a far more significant way, and that is we now know that at the same time that James Comey was openly talking about a Hillary Clinton investigation, including up until days before the election, he was not disclosing to the public that there was also an investigation of the Trump campaign. Uh, that is far more significant than any of these text messages from my point of view. Now, I don't think that was because James Comey had a political ax to grind or was doing this in a partisan way. I do think it was an error in judgment. And I think it is perfectly appropriate for us to do oversight of how that investigation was conducted. But the intent here is not to do oversight. The intent here is nothing short of discrediting Mueller, then discrediting the Justice Department, then discrediting the FBI, then discrediting the judiciary. Uh, should the judiciary convict some of the people that Mueller uh, has charged or may charge in the future? This is an effort to tear at the very idea that there is an objective truth. And I think this president, in astonishing speed, has remade the Republican Party in his own Hillary, deeply flawed you? image. And that will be ruinous to the Republican Party. But as we depend on, on a, a two-party system with two functional parties, it will also be deeply damaging to the country. The discrediting of our institutions, uh, the, the justice system, the judiciary, the press, is enormously destructive.